Hello everyone, uh, my name is Brian, I'm from Singapore. Um, as I mentioned earlier in my other videos, I'm a photo enthusiast. Um, I actually do photography quite a lot in my free time. Today I'm going to review this uh, tripod from Sure. The model number is T1004X. Um, as you can see from the outside, it comes in a uh, really handy bag. Uh, there was a box that uh, came along with it as well, along with a warranty card and all that. Um, so, it's actually quite a pretty neat bag for uh, hand carry and then it comes with a strap as well which I've kept it inside. Let's take a look at this bag. Okay, you can see taking the tripod out from this bag is not a cumbersome issue, it's really quite uh, easy. And then this bag comes along with, let me just put this down. Okay, this bag comes with a shoulder strap that you can strap it on and uh, very easily carry. For me, I really just do prefer uh, hand carry. And then it comes with uh, actually a accessories pouch inside with all the other uh, items that you can keep such as the Allen key and all that. Uh, it also comes along with this bag as well. And then on the outside, you can keep some other small items. There's another zipper uh, compartment. Okay, so that aside, okay, let's come to uh, the tripod itself. You can see the tripod um, is really a reverse folding. So once you open it up, it's got to you got to open it up the reverse way fully all the way. And there you have it. This is the structure of the tripod. Uh, one thing to note is that the tripod does not come with a head even though some countries may have a purchase option of uh, having this um, tripod head coming along uh, you know, at a special price. Okay, So uh, you can see two legs are actually foam padded uh, with the last one not padded. So for me, especially when um, I'm in colder countries, uh, if you have ever been to uh, those countries in their winter season, uh, this foam padding will really come into handy, uh, really, really come in handy because uh, this, this um, aluminium uh, leg itself uh, is not gonna, it's not gonna insulate from you know the cold. Okay, I'm just gonna set up this tripod to its full length to let you see how tall it is. So uh, to open the legs, you don't really need to open them one by one, as you, even though they slip off quite easily. Okay, for me, it's, uh, there's a trick that the guy at the camera shop taught me. Just grab all three. You can see the way I grab. Just grab all three. And twist. You can actually feel uh, a click uh, unclicking. Okay, you can hear. Okay, and let go of your hand. Up. All you need to do is to tighten later on. Do the same thing for the three. Okay, and it will fully extend. Initially, when I bought this tripod, I was wondering how tall it is, and uh, looking from the specs on on the website, you know, it might not be. Uh, would it be tall enough for me and all that but uh, once I bought it, I saw it at the shop itself uh, I wasn't worried about that at all because um, you know, with, with the height of the tripod fully extended um, without the tripod head, it's already at my kind of like uh, my neck level so with the tripod head which is almost this tall and also the camera itself it would be just nice for me to do the viewing um, for me, it's, I, I use a Nikon D7000. Um, later on, I will show you uh, the pictures of uh, how tall this thing is and uh, how it will look like. So, um, basically, this is it. And um, you can actually do low angle shots with uh, this tripod as well. So, what we usually do is you just need to unscrew the bottom. You can actually see later on, I will show you how this thing works. Um, that I have to unscrew the bottom hook. And just take this out. It's quite neat too. And uh, just fix this at the from the bottom up. 
Put it back on. And there you have it. This is uh, just need to tighten. And you can actually reverse fit your camera from the bottom and do a low, really, really low angle shot. You can, you can do this by shortening your legs. The legs of the tripod. And there you have it, this is how it will look like. So, uh, as I mentioned, this is a pretty neat tripod and it comes with a lot of other features uh, which I'm not able to cover in this video. Um, if you would like to know more about this tripod, you can actually take a look at uh, uh, you know, the Surrey um, website itself and um, it will be able to show you more features of what really this tripod is capable of. But I think uh, as a travel tripod, this this tripod is really neat. Uh, it's really very light weight. Um, sorry, let me just fix this on. And you can see actually the bottom comes with a hook. So even though this is a, a lightweight tripod, what I will do is uh, whenever I go for shoots, okay, whenever I go for shoots uh, overseas, I will actually hang my um, Flipside 400 at the bottom over here just to hold it down a little bit um, but apart from that this is a really uh, sturdy tripod and uh, it's really convenient to bring around as I mentioned it comes with a hand carry bag over here and uh, the keeping of this tripod is really quite easy as well all you need to do is just extend the head a little uh, sorry not a little but to the maximum to the top Extend it to the top and uh, release the clips from the edge of the legs. Flip it up all the way. Same here as well. You can see that there's actually some more allowance at the at the top here that you can attach your tripod head and keep it together inside the bag as well. It gives a uh, quite a good clearance, so there's good amount of space that you can still keep, uh, you know, with your tripod head attached. You don't need to separate it. And this bag is quite spacious as well, usually apart from uh, the tripod and also the shoulder strap which I keep into the bag. Over here. And uh, you know, taking selfies is really a very big thing these days. I will usually uh, put in a selfie stick by the side over here as well in the gaps. And you can see my hand. Uh, unfortunately, I do not have my selfie stick with me at the moment. My brother landed it, uh, borrowed it from me for his holiday. <laughs> so, yeah, this is it. It's a uh, Surrey T1004X. Uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. If there's any comments, feel free to drop me a PM or you can uh, drop me a message in the comments. I'll reply as soon as possible. Thank you.